Hello everyone, my name is Patrick Newt. I'm the bassist and backup folk singer for Requiem for a Dream. And I wanted to talk a little bit about uh, our singing and stuff. This is such a great band. The guys are great. We have songs about life, love, lust. So I really think you all are going to enjoy what's uh, up and coming for the new year. Um, I, I did get started in music uh, about a decade ago. In seventh grade, I picked up the bass uh, just out of coincidence for a fill-in spot as a jazz player. And it got me playing, at this point, every day. I play every day, and all you uh, bass players out there, guitarists, strings alike, just keep at it. The hard work's gonna pay off. Just shave off time, try to play it an hour a day if you can, or if you cut that in half, um, it will get better. Uh, we have an album coming out, it's our debut album, with 11 songs, uh, looking at a New Year's release date, and are currently in the process of recording that with Dave here today, so. That's uh, that's going really good. I, I've played in many bands in and out of school. Um, I was in a band with our drummer years ago in high school called The Vanishing Point, and that was uh, 2004 through 2006. And then, you know, just we all went our separate ways and there's no bad blood and everything's, you know, really good and remained friends and um, I think the guys that I play with now in Requiem are the best at, at what they do. I think we're all the best at what we do, and, and that's why we work, ultimately. I mean, if I can make it that easy. Um, not to mention these guys, you know, pull their weight in, then so everybody seems really positive and, you know, real optimistic about the future. And uh, I think that's only going to wield good things for us in the years to come. Um, there is a there is a rather bigger history to Requiem for a Dream than what meets the eye. I know uh, this band has only been up and off the ground for four months now. However, back in 2007, um, the summer the summer of our lives, uh, we were all in a band called Tora. And uh, if any of the other members have told you about Tora, Tora was great. I mean, we pretty much made, made it a job without having a job. We didn't do any, any website or play any shows, but by God, we were in the practice room five days a week for 25, 30 hours a week. And we're pretty much the same, the same members. Uh, everyone in Requiem was in that band. and It's just great to take a, take a year off and come back and everyone's really, really serious about this and, you know, taking it to the next level. Definitely doing a music video soon. Um, November is when we decided to do that. Hopefully we can get it done sooner. As you said, the weather is great out here today. And I mean, this is this is the kind of weather we, I think we need to, to pull that off. We're looking at two possible songs for it. Um, one is Sunglasses, uh, which is on our website at myspace backslash requiemverdream.com. The other one is would be worth it, I'm pretty sure. Um, we're gonna storyboard some stuff out and, you know, go from there. In five years, I see Requiem for a Dream climbing to the top of the pyramid. I think uh, that these guys have paid their dues. We've all put in the time and dedication, you know, and the wrenching with the band sometimes when you live together, you practice together, you work together, and you fight together. I think it's all part of it. So, you know, five years down the road, ten years down the road, keep your eyes peeled. We'll be coming. We'll be there.